Okay, so next we're going to be doing more of an intermediate to advanced triceps workout. Now, as you'll remember, your triceps account for 70% of your entire arm region. So if you really want to maximize your arm development in a short amount of time, it's really critical that you go in and isolate the three major heads of the triceps, which is the lateral head, the long head, and the medial head. And that's exactly what we're going to do in today's workout. So we're going to start here by using the water jugs. And we're just going to lay flat on the floor and I'm just going to extend my arms over my head. Now in one motion, I'm just going to descend the water jugs down almost until the point where they come in contact with my forehead. Now when I reach this point, I'm just going to extend both arms again and I'm going to pause and contract my triceps at the peak point of each rep. Really important here, there should only be movement in your forearms, okay? Your shoulders, your biceps, and your triceps should be stationary at all times. And we're just going to stay within this range of motion right here. Putting a lot of tension on the lateral head of the triceps, right? And these are called skull crushers. We're going to be doing them for 30 seconds straight. Get your timers out. Here we go. Slow, especially when you're descending the jugs down. Stay in control. Keep your back on the floor. Avoid using momentum. All right, 30 seconds is up. Right into exercise number two. So we're going to be using the pull-up bar here uh, in a little bit of an unorthodox way, right? This is going to be a closed grip push-up variation that's going to work all three heads of the triceps. So we're going to put the pull-up bar here and we're just going to establish a grip with our hands roughly, I'd say three to four inches apart, okay? I'm going to balance all my weight on my toes and I'm going to stay completely horizontal with my upper body. And I'm actually going to arch my body forward. So when I come down, the goal here is to have my upper abdominals come in contact with the bar. Okay? If we have our chest come in contact with the bar, that's going to work more of our lower chest, which is fine, but that's not really the objective that we're trying to achieve here. Okay? So we're just going to come down. Really important that we keep our elbows as tight as possible to our core, and then we're just going to come up until we can't come up anymore. And when our arms are fully extended, we're just gonna pause and contract our triceps. We're just gonna stay within this range of motion right here. Okay? We're gonna do this for 25 straight seconds. Get your timers ready. Here we go. Go as slow as possible. Look ahead. These are definitely going to be tougher than your standard close grip push-ups. They're also going to get you a lot more results. All right. All right, so in our second circuit workout, we're going to be gradually increasing the level of difficulty here. Once again, we're going to be utilizing everyday home appliances so we can add some moderate to heavy weight to the lateral head, the long head, and the medial head of the triceps. So our next exercise is something called overhead triceps extensions. Now typically you would need a gym membership and a cable machine to perform this exercise, but we're going to get a little creative here, and as you can see, we're using the suitcase and a towel. And what we're going to do is we're just going to tie the towel on the top handle of the suitcase. We're going to establish a grip with our thumbs pointing down and then we're just going to hoist the suitcase behind our head. Now we're going to stand with our feet roughly shoulder width apart and then I'm going to keep my elbows in tight. And in one motion, all I'm going to do is I'm just going to extend my arms up above my head. And then when I can't go any further, I'm going to rotate outwards. And this rotation here is really going to be hitting our long head and medial head really, really hard. We're just going to slowly come down until we can't come any further. And we're just going to stay within this range of motion right here. Maybe a little uncomfortable. 
but I promise you're going to love the results. And we're going to be doing this for 30 straight seconds. Get your timers out. Here we go. Rotate outwards. Try to keep your elbows tight to your head. You'll feel the burn if you're doing this correctly, I promise you. Right. 30 seconds is up. Now we're going into our second exercise of our second circuit workout. And this is something called skull crush push-ups. These are really, really difficult to do, so we're not gonna be using the clock. We really wanna monitor our rep counts here and make sure that we're executing proper flawless form at all times. So we're gonna be utilizing the pull-up bar. We're just gonna put it down. We're gonna establish the same closed grip that we did when we did our conventional closed grip push-up. But what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna extend my body completely horizontal and then I'm just going to come down until my forehead comes in contact with the bar and then I'm going to press up. And you're really going to feel this in all three heads of the tricep when done correctly. Now, once again, this is really difficult, so I want you to shoot for five to seven good solid reps for each set. Go as slow as possible. Here we go. 